In this video, we will discuss what exactly is PEX tubing, the different types of PEX, and the benefits it has over copper pipe. Firstly, what exactly is PEX tubing? PEX tubing is a cross-link polyethylene pipe manufactured by adding a catalyst to the thermoplastic resin. Picture a chain-link fence where the metal links are actually bonded or welded together. PEX tubing is available in a variety of lengths and diameter sizes. It also comes in a variety of colors, such as red for carrying hot water, blue, which is used for carrying cold water, white, which can be used for either hot or cold water, orange. Orange PEX pipe is an oxygen barrier pipe used for only for hydronic heating applications. There are three types of PEX, PEX A, PEX B, and PEX C. Contrary to popular belief, A, B, and C are not grades of PEX. These letters are used merely to identify the manufacturing process and have nothing to do with the quality of the end product. PEX A. This tubing is produced using a peroxide method. Some of the pros for using PEX A tubing are, it has the highest flexibility and is the only PEX available to be used with cold expansion connections. PEX A tubing also has the highest degree of cross-linking and has no coil memory. As well, any kinks in the tubing can be repaired using a heat gun. Cost. It is the most expensive type of PEX and a lower bursting pressure than PEX B. PEX B. This tubing is produced using a silane or moisture cure method of cross-linking. Some of the pros for using this type of PEX are cost. It is the lower cost of PEX tubing. It has the highest bursting pressure as well as being the most resistant to chlorine, making it a good choice in area where water is highly chlorinated. This is the most commonly used type of PEX tubing. Some of the cons of PEX B tubing are that it is stiffer than PEX A tubing, as well as having a significantly more coil memory. Kinks cannot be repaired. PEX C tubing is manufactured using electronic irradiation method of cross-linking, also known as cold cross-linking. Some of the pros for using this type of PEX include little to no coil memory, as well as being more environmentally friendly to manufacture. The cons for using PEX-C would be that it has the least uniform cross-linking, as well as being prone to develop cracks. This is the least commonly used type of PEX. Over the last 20 to 25 years, PEX tubing has taken off in its popularity and is now a more popular choice than copper for many reasons. First and foremost is cost, both in material cost as well as labor cost to install. Next, PEX expands, making it more resistant to freeze cracking than copper. PEX is available in long runs, therefore reducing the number of fittings required and reducing pressure drop. Another reason PEX is more favorable than using copper pipe is water flows silently through PEX, eliminating water hammer noise associated with metal piping. And lastly, PEX tubing does not develop calcium deposits in it, unlike copper pipe. I hope you now have a better understanding of what PEX is, the different types of PEX available, and why it is a better choice than copper pipe for your next plumbing project.